If there's anything that I've done that I could do better is uh, have more experts with differing opinions right after I have the controversial ones. Joe Rogan is now responding to the drama surrounding his Spotify podcast. On Sunday night, he posted a message to Instagram pledging to do better about bringing balanced opinions concerning COVID-19 on his podcast. He's accused of spreading false information about the virus and vaccines on his podcast. Well-known musicians like Neil Young are removing their music from Spotify in protest. Alexander Lewis connects the dots. Here's some quick background. Joe Rogan hosts the Joe Rogan Experience, one of the most popular podcasts on Spotify. He's become a pretty vocal COVID skeptic, suggesting that healthy younger people didn't need the vaccine, though he says he's not an anti-vaxxer. Then last month, he talked with Dr. Robert Malone, who made false claims about COVID-19. That kicked the controversy up a notch. YouTube took down clips of that interview, but Spotify didn't. By the way, Twitter banned that doctor for spreading misinformation. Soon after that interview, an open letter signed by hundreds of doctors, nurses, and scientists called for its removal from Spotify. But it was singer-songwriter Neil Young who really kicked off the protests. He asked for his music to be removed, saying he didn't want to share the platform with Rogan. Sunday, singer-songwriter Joni Mitchell followed suit. Spotify says it won't remove the podcast, but will add a content advisory to those that discuss COVID-19 with a link to the platform's fact-based COVID hub. In a statement, the CEO said it is important we don't take on the position of being content censor while making sure there are rules in place and consequences for those who violate them. As for Rogan, he denies spreading misinformation, saying he only wanted to have conversations with people who have differing opinions, though he did say he will try to do better. And that's Connecting the Dots. For Nine News Mornings, I'm Alexandra Lewis.